It starts with heat. From heat comes strength. And from strength comes progress. At Nucor Steel Nebraska, we melt, refine, and cast the steel it takes to keep America moving. Roads, bridges, buildings, they all start with steel, one of the strongest, most durable products known to man. But at Nucor, we don't just make steel, we recycle it. With our modern steel recycling technology, we are able to keep junk out of landfills, use less energy and natural resources, and prove every day that manufacturing is still the backbone of a healthy American economy. From the scrapyard to the sky rise, the steel to rebuild America is being made right here in Norfolk by the dedicated teammates at Nucor Steel Nebraska. Everything starts with safety. Our commitment to working safely stems from our belief that a safe team leads to a strong team, and a strong team means a strong business. Our steel making process begins when we take scrap that would otherwise end up in landfills and sort it for recycling into new, high quality steel. Different types of scrap have different properties. We carefully combine our scrap so it will recycle into steel to match customer specifications. Recycling scrap is only part of Nucor Steel Nebraska's environmental stewardship. We have an extensive environmental program for both our steel making process and the local environment, all designed to ensure that our process is clean and safe. Once sorted, our cranes drop the scrap into furnace ladles where it will be melted down and refined in our melt shop. The driving force behind our steel process is the electric arc furnace, or EAF. Our 700 volt EAF uses 77,000 kilowatts to melt scrap into 3,000 degree Fahrenheit molten steel, a process that is significantly more energy efficient than making steel in traditional steel furnaces. Once steel is melted in our EAFs, our teammates refine the steel's chemistry before sending it on to the caster. At the caster, liquid steel is poured through molds and cooled into long strands called billets. The billet is the first time our steel starts to look like a product. These billets are cooled and stored until they are ready to be rolled into final products. The final step in the steel making process takes place in the roll mill First, billets are reheated to approximately 2,100 degrees Fahrenheit, a temperature at which they are malleable. Then they move on to the roll stands. To reduce a steel billet into a final product requires pressure, a lot of it. As a billet travels through our rolling mill, thousands of pounds of pressure are applied through each mill stand. A 35-foot long billet can be transformed into an 865 foot long, one and a half inch thick product in a matter of minutes. Once rolled, our steel products are cut, packaged and shipped via rail and truck to customers around the United States. It takes a solid foundation to build something strong and lasting, and our customers rely on our steel to provide lasting strength to their projects. But at Nucor, our strength starts with our people. We believe in giving every teammate the power to take ownership and make decisions on the job, minimizing layers of management and red tape. The result is a remarkably innovative and motivated team that excels in both safety and productivity. At Nucor Steel Nebraska, we are proud to be America's largest steel maker and recycler and look forward to being an important part of the Norfolk community for years to come. At Newcore Steel Nebraska, we take care of our customers. At Newcore Steel Nebraska, safety and quality are our core values. We are American proud. We are Newcore proud. At Newcore. We're proud to be America's largest steel manufacturer and recycler. Thank you for visiting Newcore Steel Nebraska.